The Boston Red Sox getting ready to face off against the New York Yankees in a three-game series this weekend at Fenway. And this as the Sox owners are hoping to make a big change to part of Fenway's history by renaming Yawkey Way. Now, the street is named after the team's former owner, Thomas Yawkey, whose team became the last to start and an African-American player in the major leagues. Eyewitness Sports reporter Ruthie Polinski is in Boston now with reaction to this proposal. We spoke to fans here on Yawkey Way prior to tonight's Red Sox-Yankees game, and we found that opinions on whether or not the name of the historic street should be changed are mixed. I just think it's history. It's been this way forever. Why change it? It's still, it's still history. We don't rewrite history books. Yawkey Way is very tradition, very much uh, steeped in tradition, so I'd like to see it stay the same name. Even though there are the political connotations. You know, there's political connotations with everything. It's before my time. It's nothing that I was a part of, so it's nothing that I want to be a part of. I think it's a great idea to name it after Big Poppy. I heard they were going to possibly name it after Big Poppy. Excellent idea for Big Poppy. There has been some discussion about whether or not the street should be named after David Ortiz. Maybe Big Poppy Way is in our future. Reporting outside Fenway Park, I'm Ruthie Polinski, Eyewitness Sports.